Hello! This is a talk about Fusion 360 and how to manage a collection of parts based on a single design. This is also called configurations. The purpose is to design only once a model and then to keep some variations as we play with parameters. Fusion 360 doesn't propose yet an integrated tool to manage part collections. In the meantime, we deal with workarounds. I chose to keep my parts in the same file. In this case, each part is kept in a component. I designed this box. It is my base box. Then I copy pasted it several times to obtain these other boxes. They are all different and still quite familiar. They have some joints to attach them together. Depending on the wanted box size, I select the number of joints I need. There are two parameters for this. They affect only the base box. That's what I want. I change another parameter value. It adjusts the depth of all boxes, not only the base box. That's also what I want. Changing parameter values affect all sketches and features that have a reference to those parameters. Thus, for each bug variation, I removed some parameter references inside its component. Let's see this with an example. I duplicate the component that contains the base box using copy, then pass new functions. I leave the new component in place. I activate it and I rename it. I want it to be a variation of one join by four joints. I move the body, not the whole component, using the translate option. The translate option is parametric, the free move option is not. I move it in such a way that all boxes display attached without overlapping. I delete two features. I don't need any more the rectangular pattern features for the one joint side of this box variation. I edit the other two rectangular pattern features by removing the parameter reference and set four joints for the other side. Finally, I edit the sketch similarly that is, removing the parameter references that set box sides. Let's see another example. This time I'm not duplicating the base box. I duplicate the already made one by one box variation. Same actions as previously. Copy, pass new, leave the component in place. Body move using the translate option. All boxes are attached without overlapping. Now I edit the extrude feature that created the eight of the box. I don't remove the parameter reference. I change the expression so that the eight of this box variation is half that of all other boxes. That's it. Done. Nice collection of attached boxes. And now the final game. How the boxes are affected by parameter value changes. Three joints on the X direction, also three joints on the Y direction. Only the base box is affected. Changing the aid. Now all boxes are affected. 
And this concludes this presentation about one possible way to obtain variations from one designed model. I hope you found it useful.